Ular Calmed Unmanned Surface Vehicle, AUSV, developed by Turkish companies Maytakes and Defense and Uri's Shipyard, successfully completed missile firing tests during Turkish Navy's Sea Wolf 2021 naval exercise. Two Sirit laser-guided missiles fired from Ular Korsf and both of them successfully hit the target. The Ular Korsf firing ceremony, attended by senior officials from Turkey's Presidency of Defense Industries, Ministry of Defense, Turkish Naval Forces Command, and Coast Guard Command, was started with the speeches of Uri's shipyard CEO Utku Allens and Maytakes and Defense President Selçuk Alparslan. Uri's shipyard CEO Utku Allens expressed that with the completion of the firing tests, they are aiming to develop the world's best unmanned surface vehicles and pioneer the world as Turkish engineers in this field. He also underlined that they have targeted to bring Turkey in a leading position in the world, creating trends in the field of USVs, just like the indigenous house. After the opening speeches, Ula Korsf, which was positioned in the south of Antalya Bay with Turkish Navy's other combatant man platforms, took action and was directed from the Mobile Coastal Control Station, MCCS, and transferred to the firing area. The Naval Forces Command and Coast Guard Command platforms also accompanied the firing. After the target was detected by sensors on the Ulaq, Sirit laser-guided missiles were fired and resulted with direct hit on the target. Ulaq course can be operated via mobile vehicles on land and from headquarters command center or from floating platforms such as aircraft carriers and frigates in the execution of missions such as reconnaissance, surveillance, and intelligence surface warfare, asymmetric warfare, armed escort, and force protection, critical facility security. The system is equipped with four Sirit and two El Umtas missile systems provided by Turkey's missile systems manufacturer Roketsun. Ulur Korsf can also be configured with different types of payloads such as extended range surface-to-surface, surface-to-ground, surface-to-air missiles, electronic warfare, jamming and different communication and intelligence systems as well as missile systems to meet different operational needs. Moreover Ular Korsf, which has the ability to operate with other OSFs with equal or different structure, and conduct joint operations with OSFs, AWAVs, TWAVs and manned aircraft, is not only a remotely controlled unmanned vehicle, but a state-of-the-art autonomous vessel with superior capabilities thanks to its artificial intelligence features. Following the OSF version, which is the first phase of the project initiated by URI's shipyard and may take some defense, unmanned surface vehicles for intelligence and electronic warfare, mine hunting, anti-submarine warfare, firefighting and humanitarian aid slash evacuation will also be commenced for production.